Bradley Carraway has been found guilty of reckless homicide in DUI in the 2016 crash that killed the former U of L cheerleader. But the jury did not think the more severe charges of murder and second degree manslaughter held up. Kennedy Hayes joins us live from the Jefferson County Judicial Center with more on the verdict and the sentence. Myra and John, the jury deliberated for about four and a half hours before they found Bradley Carraway guilty of reckless homicide and DUI, but not guilty of murder or manslaughter. Carraway will not have to serve any prison time and essentially is a free man. Now, to give you some background on this case, seven years ago in August 2016, prosecutors allege Carraway was driving his Honda sedan on Interstate 64 under the influence of alcohol. With him in the car, 25 year old former U of L cheerleader Shanae Mormon. Mormon died when the car crashed and rolled over. Carraway's attorneys argued he was not the one driving, but the jury disagreed. We heard from both the defense and the prosecution after the verdict was read. No one wins in anything like this, but we are so just so, so very fortunate for the jury and, and the outcome for today. Way waived his final sentencing and again will not have to serve prison time. He does have six years of credit for home incarceration. Reporting live, Kennedy Hayes, Wave News.